Hello, my name is Michael Kaler, and I am the lab manager of the IM Diffraction Facility located at the University of Tennessee, Knoxville. This video will focus on the Expert 3 MRD from Malvern Panalytical. In order to switch to point focus, you come in here to Instrument Settings, and you can double-click on this. Click on Point Focus and Apply. This says, please remove all prefix modules, but nothing inside really moves for this process, so I will ignore this and just click Next. You should then see the voltage and amperage decrease, and eventually they will go to zero. We see that the screen says to turn off the high tension key, so we will rotate that so that the light turns off. It then says to make sure the x-ray tube is in point focus. Let me grab the needed tools. Hopefully you have one of these. I'll open it up and I want to use this one. It's the T27. I believe that works well. We are then going to go to the back of the instrument, and then what we want to do is loosen this right up here. Eventually, the back door here will open up, and you'll probably hear a slight click. Here we see the back of the x-ray tube, so we want to push these two clips forward to loosen the collar. We have to work these hooks off where they latch on to. Pull it back to let it rest down there on its own. You see that there is this little rod here that goes into a seating position. All we are going to do is pull the entire tube back somewhat. We can pull it from the water lines. We now see that the little rod has come out. Even if I try to pull it more, it's not going to come out more in this position. I will then rotate it counterclockwise, and we have this little rod here that goes into the well. I'll push it back in. And that's it. You've now rotated the tube. I'll take this, slide it back up, get the clips to go back on there. Sometimes this can be a little tricky. Sometimes it's really quick and easy latch them down. I usually like to move these around a little bit to make sure that everything is sitting in there without a bunch of tension. That's it for what you need to do to the tube. I will now close up the doors. And then we'll tighten this up. Hopefully it works just tightening it up. We might have to try to pick the door up a little bit. Usually I just use my knee down low to pick it up a bit if it isn't really screwing in well. And then just tighten it up. And there we go. We are now in point focus, so I can click next. This says to turn the high tension key back on, so I will turn that. There we see the lights come back on, and then the numbers should start increasing in a moment. They will start out at 15 and 5, and then increase to 30 and 10. We can click Next on the screen. And then you can turn your tension and current up to 45 and 40. And then you are good to go in your point focus mode. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comment section below. Otherwise, Benjamin and I thank you for watching and we hope you have a great day.